Hey everyone, John here, and welcome back to the Toy Box. How are you guys doing today? I hope you're having a great day. Are you ready for more third generation Pokemon Center Sitting Cuties plushes? Today, we are going to take a look at a Pokemon that is not only rock hard, but also hard as steel. I'm talking about Aaron. So sit back, relax, and enjoy. Well, I still remember seeing my first Aaron in Pokemon Sapphire. It was in Granite Cave right before Brawley's gym. When I saw Aaron, my first question was, what was that? It looked kind of like a small dog wearing a skull. But anyways, once I learned from both Pokédexes that this Pokémon eats metal and can destroy a dump truck, I absolutely had to have it. Aaron was on my original team, and it was especially useful against Pokémon that I knew only had normal or flying-type moves. I try not to remember Aaron taking its first earthquake, or a karate chop, or any ground or fighting-type moves for that matter. So, I think Aaron is one of the Pokemon that benefits from being in the Sitting Cuties line the most, and that's really based on availability. I don't think we would be getting an Aaron plush otherwise, and that's a shame because I really like this Pokemon. So let's take a look at the plush. So Aaron has a lot of details to look at, and I think the plush is very well done because it actually looks like Aaron is wearing the suit of armor. And that those suit of armor looks like separate pieces. But that's actually not the case. So if we take a look at Aaron's head first. This is all one piece. The, the head. So it's all the, the sil it's silver. The, all the dots in here are embroidered. So you can see that here. Here's a couple more for the nose. And look at We have Aaron smiling. So you cannot say that Aaron is not friendly, because Aaron is smiling. That's another detail that you wouldn't see right off the bat, and I love it that the Sitting Cuties plushes have those. I think it's a good job. Now the eyes here are a separate piece. Uh, I believe that they are done with this blue material, and they're sewn into the plush at this point. It's kind of indented in, so it's nice. The rest of the eye, this part right here, is embroidered. But that's the head. Let's take a look at the body. The pellets for the Sitting Cuties plush are really, they're centered all around this area, like the lower half of the plush, as we would expect. We have a couple more spots here that are embroidered. Of course, you have to have Aaron's spike. It's very sharp. Be careful. I like this little strap coming down here because it actually looks like the it's part, of, it look, it's part of the illusion that makes it look like these are all separate pieces, but they're, they're really not. But it's really nice. Now the legs are very short, and they're stubby. And that's kind of what I would expect. You can see the other side right here. And then now let's take a look at the tag. So here is the tag for Sitting Cuties Aaron. You can see it right there. Then here's the other tag. And of course we have the, the same three. Now let's take a look at how Aaron stands. I'm bringing this up because this is actually, I think this is the first Sitting Cuties plush, maybe other than Zubat, that has a bit of trouble standing on its own. Or sitting on its own. And I think it's because the head weighs so much, so a lot of times I have to balance it like that. But sometimes I'm able to balance it. Well, I had it before. But sometimes I can balance it on its feet. Really depends on how the plush is feeling at that time, I guess. But anyways... I'm just going to go ahead and let Aaron sit for a bit. I don't know about you guys, but all of a sudden I really just have the urge to find a dump truck. I want to see if Aaron can really flip it, but I think he's probably just going to eat it. Well, this has been the Pokemon Center Aaron Sitting Cuties plush. What do you guys think of Aaron? And what Aaron stories do you have for us? Let me know in the comments section. If you're interested in Aaron, I'll put a link to Pokemon Center in the description. Well, that's all I have for you guys today. I really hope you enjoyed today's video. Thank you so much for watching, and as always, rate, subscribe, and don't stop playing.